как правильно uh, нужно поступать, чтобы в кратчайшие сроки избавиться. What is the right thing to do in order to promptly get rid of a negative energetic entity attached to you for some reason? Yes, colleagues, we live in a quite aggressive world, particularly from an energo-informational point of view. People generate an enormous amount of negative emotions. Sometimes these emotions turn into certain free living entities called larvae. When large numbers of people gather in one place and experience the same emotion, a super larva forms over that space. It begins not only to drain energy from a person, but also to nourish him, constantly sending him specific impulses. It's not even information, but just impulses of a specific frequency that make a person resonate with this exact frequency. This is how the crowd effect is formed. This is how various events, say, of a destructive nature, are formed. When people start smashing everything around, not understanding why they are doing it. The crowd effect is a terrible thing. A revolt, senseless and ruthless, as it was called by the Russian classics. But nowadays, people are in such a state that this sort of thing is just spilling out of them. You don't know what to do about your negative emotions. Physical activity has decreased, and social opportunities to express emotions have also decreased. This is, of course, why people's space is saturated with these sorts of things. Sensitive people, unprotected people, children, and elderly, and people in emotional distress are, in a way, such elements of vulnerability. How to defend yourself? There are several ways. Firstly, strengthen your energy, meaning strengthen your etheric body. This is what we learn in our first course. A dense etheric body gets rid of these problems on its own. Watch your emotional state, meaning don't give in to total state of despair or emotional distress, and cleanse your astral body regularly. Secondly, have a strong enough worldview, meaning that your worldview should be formed by your own self and shouldn't be borrowed from someone else. Three, defend yourself magically. Have a protective amulet. A protective amulet works according to a principle. It does all of this for you, not you. It defends your etheric and astral bodies from negative emotions and perhaps even preserving or forming your specific worldview. Wholesome, versatile, strong amulets work just like that, usually defending their owner from this sort of interference. Although ideally, you need to know how to defend yourself and be able to do so yourself. The basal state I am as I am, which you are constantly working with, and many of the present here are very familiar with, generally performs the same function. Another thing is that in contrast to a protective amulet, the basal state forces consciousness to work. After all, the basal state is an energetic, informational and spiritual work. Hence, it is more effective, because each deflected attack gives you a certain additional power level, if speaking in terms of computer games. You, Marina, need to learn to defend yourself. For one, take a look at the aggressive environment you're in. What you've done and described is an absolutely correct mechanism to get rid of this harmful entity. You physically activated your etheric body, charged your energy a little, calmed the astral body. Everything you've done, you've done right. And on top of that, you've given work to your mental body and asked the right question in the right place. Hence the conclusion, you are in possession of all the mechanisms to remove this. So what is the problem? You need to stop being afraid of it. A huge number of viruses are flying all around us. We now know it all very well, not only the one that is advertised daily, but also millions of others. Think of these larvae as viruses. With good immunity, you won't even notice it, and your immune system will chew it up, remember it, spit it out and say, I know this one.
I know how to fight it. And if you are going to perceive negative energetic entities and emotional environment this way, you will soon become a very powerful witch without a care in the world.